government officials in Australia uh, conducted an audit to look into what type of websites government officials are looking into, mm -hmm. right? So um, what they found is two right-wing politicians in Australia were visiting several porn sites. In fact, one of them... Of course! Of course! In fact, one of them is Fred Niles. Um, he is part of the right-wing Christian Democratic Party in Australia. Mm -hmm. And the audit found that he visited more than 200,000 pornographic websites. Okay, 200,000. 200,000. No, no, but here comes my favorite things of all time. He said it was for, quote, research purposes. He just had to keep researching and researching. All of a sudden, no research. Researching, researching, no research. Researching, 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 no research. <laughs> that, uh, my guess is that's the pattern that his research took him on. Mm. <laughs> okay. Uh, look, worldwide, America, Afghanistan, Australia, it doesn't matter where you go. If there's someone on a moral crusade, watch out. Okay, right. this is the least of it. Now, this story takes a interesting twist because <laughs> always <laughs> all of a sudden there was an investigation into the investigation. Yes. Okay. Politics. Right, and this investigation found that the websites that were uh, named as pornographic websites weren't pornographic at all. They were actually mainstream news sites. Some of them. Okay. And I believe that that error could happen, right? right. You know, like that you go to a, a website and it's got, you know, serious stories, but it also got bikini shots, it gets right. recrossed, etc. But that dude was on 200,000 sites. Right. And when they busted him, he didn't say, what the hell are you talking about? I was on government websites. He said he was doing it for research purposes. Okay. So my guess is it's both true. And look, they shouldn't be doing these investigations in the first place. No, okay. I agree with that. Right. And they said, oh, he was also on gambling websites. Ah, let him go, man. I mean, other than his hypocrisy, so the guy was looking at a little porn and gambling a little bit on at work. There but for the grace of God. Who hasn't gambled at work? Online. Okay. But of course, it's the moral crusader who, who got caught with his hand in the cookie jar. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, by the way, if we ever get busted uh, for some sort of porn, like as if like what, what's there to get busted, right? Right. Right. But uh, we will be the only people in America that actually did research. No, that's one hundred percent true. Yeah, and then when we say research purposes, people are like, oh, right, 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 sure, sure, sure. I'm like, no, no, we do a show. We talk about porn all the time. They're like, oh, no, 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 no